and I think my heart might burst from it. <laughs> I hope so. Hello guys, welcome back. I'm Julian. I'm here to do my reaction video for episode 21 of season 4 of Marvel's Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. This time the title of the episode is The Return and I am excited as hell to continue watching Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. to finally be done with this season so I only have episode 21 and episode 22 to watch for this amazing mind-blowing season out of the like the three arcs that we had like the first one with the Ghost Rider was amazing with the introduction of the Ghost Rider. I was so confused, but I loved it. And then after that, uh, the uh, LMD uh, uh, arc, which I loved as well. And he kind of that one set up everything for the final arc. And this final arc has been just the best episodes of television history that I have ever watched it's so 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 freaking good I I just yeah like I so far you know I love this is my favorite show like I have said many times fringe uh and right now I I love Game of Thrones I love Westworld I love how to get away with murder Riverdale everything but this one right here is going to be my top show all like after this one, but very close, not not like it's probably a tie. My favorite all time, my all time favorite show, right there, Agents of Shield. It's just amazing. So everyone minus Mac are back into our reality. Uh, Adam still has fits because. We hate her, and I don't know why she did that. And I understand that it's not like she has power, but she has that type of powers that the the other ones w that were in the box w back in the Ghost Rider uh, arc, they also c could appear and disappear. So I'm guessing that is what, what he's doing. Fitz blames himself for everything that happened. So what I'm going to do is like enjoy this uh, new episode. I hate Ada with all my heart, and now she is a human, so now we can properly kill the bitch. But also, are they too many issues with with building a body for someone? Because if there isn't, I think, you know, there's a few people from that universe that I would love to see to come back, you know. Trip, even War, that version of War... And Max's daughter. If I could only choose one, it will be Max's daughter and Trip and War. <laughs> I can decide. But honestly, I will love that. Uh, amazing season. I hope you guys are enjoying my reaction videos. This episode is posted uh, on Patreon on Monday, October 15. And it will be posted on YouTube the following week on October. Let me see. On Monday, October 22, and the season finale for, if you're watching this on YouTube, the season finale will come on f on Friday, October 26. For Patreons, the season finale will come tomorrow, Tuesday, October 16. So yeah, in case you guys want to have early access, on cover reactions, movie reactions, and a bunch of other cool things like the bloopers for this season. I will react after I'm done with the season and will react to the bloopers. Uh, you can do that by joining my Patreon page. Link will be in the description down below. So yeah, in case you guys want to do that and support the channel. Anyways, give it a lot of thumbs up if you love Marvel's Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Subscribe for more. Comment in the comment section down below. And that's it. Without further ado, let's just begin with Season 4, Episode 21 of Marvel's Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Yeah. Same for Linda. Same. He's in human powers now? Can we get a break, please? <laughs> yeah, true. I guess they weren't assessing powers at Hydra as much as collecting them. Who even knows what Hydra oh. was doing? Oh. Oh, wait. Nice to see you again. Oh, that is Actually, true. You. Yeah, true. We got out of there. It wasn't love. Oh, my God. Shoot at him. You're only you can go ahead and shoot him. Oh, my God. The head. The head. The head. The head. Oh my god! Oh my god, she's just recovering, you bitch! Without the shield, 
to a high bowing. Actually, he has a shield, bitch! <laughs> bitch! Like yeah. You missed a fair amount. Oh, Lord, my queen. I love that it's for Linda against the. Oh my god. How many? It's good to be back. Yeah, true, my queen. I have missed you so much. It's Agents of Shield now. We're now Agents of Hydra. Because we left our world, I understand. The robot version of myself. Yes, queen. Just to clarify. Yes. The technical term is Android. But yeah. <laughs> you remember any of that? Yeah, because you're never robotic at all. <laughs> yeah, true. But... <laughs> really? How long did it take you to figure it out? Oh, shit. Wow. I'm hurt, Phil. Oh. I guess I'm not as close as I thought. Oh, but my God. Attempted. So, how did things end with Robbie Reyes? Oh, she's Last in that. Remember? We were chasing down his uncle. Oh, you know, guy tried to become a god. So we opened up a portal beneath his quantum power cube. Yeah. And Ghost Rider dragged him to another dimension with his hellfire chain. Yeah. So uh, things ended well then. <laughs> yeah, true. <laughs> Man, what are you opening that bottle of hate? Yeah, About totally. that. Hey, but listen. Escape is not an Shit. option. Shit. She's going to feel hurt when she finds out that he actually opened it. Mm. Feeling the drama, I'm here for it. As long as at the end of the day, they... Mm, mm, and maybe... Mm, mm, as well. I'm disgusted. Oh, I love this. Oh, Jesus Christ. Kamikaze! Oh my god, hurry up! Okay, fine. Go, go, go! Shoot at him! Bitch! Oh, my boy. Drown her. She can drown now. But she has inhuman powers? How is that even possible? The water rushing over. Oh, so yeah, so beautiful, so beautiful. Yeah, yeah. In order to survive, the get away, from, get away from him. Leopold belongs to Gemma Siemens. Get away, get out. You're hot, but get out. But you, you manipulated. Him. Yes, you did. Every decision you made was your own. You manipulated the him. Your relationship with your father to connect with someone. Dude, I. I, I Taking this crap. Ada, kindly go and drown yourself. Please. It's an amazing experience as well. Not really, but you know what I mean. Is you. You're about to know what heartbreak is it's about, sweetheart. Because he he belongs to someone else. Just shut the fuck up and get don't touch him. Don't touch my child. <gasps> Can she stop appearing and disappearing? Because I hate that. So he she has the same power that the do you remember the blinding human used to have? That is a power that she has. If she's inhuman, kinda, I don't know. Sweetheart, I know that. It's. It's yo 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 yo. I know that this is a lot to take because she hasn't experienced and hasn't seen everything that has happened on the frame. And I understand her, okay? To him, hope is all he knows. He doesn't have the memories, he, he doesn't remember Yo-Yo, he doesn't remember the fact that he lost his kid in a world, like, to any parent who loves their kids. If you can live in a world where you kid that died in the real world and is alive in somewhere else, I will choose that. It doesn't matter who I love in the other world. It's your kid. It's something that comes from you. It, it like I I honestly can't and never will judge Matt's decision to stay. And you guys know how crazy I am about Matt Yo-Yo. You know how much I love Yo-Yo, you know? You guys know that. But it's her kid. Maybe if he could have seen yo-yo and you know she can explain that he still has a future that sadly this world can end at any minute and he could die there maybe he will have say something but you have to respect that for him this is all he knows this is his child and in a another world he doesn't have that child then he will decide to stay in this one I, I, I cannot judge him even though I love Mac Yo-Yo. Even if, even if this is the end of Mac Yo-Yo, I will still not blame him. 
might give me enough adrenaline to take on the turn. No, 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 no. Take them myself. I don't want any more bad to happen to you. Oh me? my God. I got out unscathed. Jeff, I need to take one for the team. You'll be no, useless no. Afterwards. Unconscious or unresponsive. Well, so you give me mouth to mouth. Whoop. By the way. Phil, did I try to kill you? Oh, that is a Lisa fuck prop. That's what happened. You tried. It was messed up. <laughs> well, let's add it to the list. Just make sure I'm still breathing when the team arrives. Oh huh? my god, she's so clueless. I love this, though. But, like, sweetheart, you have to tell her. She's gonna feel terrible. But also could bring them together. Since when am I ro a romantic? What the hell has happened to me? I hate romance, but here I am. <gasps> Shippy feeling that with all I have. <laughs> and we're not gonna rest until we take them down. So we're back to Sheila's exactly our terrorist. Shit. She's so smiling like this is a good thing. How about you, uh, dear Ada? I'm gonna teach you something we humans, decent humans, do. Consent. It's a really fun thing. You know, you wanna do something. Okay, whatever it is. You want to do it. So, in order for the other person to do it as well, you ask. Would you like to do this thing that I want to do? Do you like, you, do you want to do it? That person will have a choice to say yes or no. If he says, he or she says yes, then you proceed with it. If she says no, then you stop. <sighs> when are we going to kill her? <laughs> Irritates me so much. My poor boy looking at me so handsome. <sighs> Dude, stop it! Consent! <gasps> oh my god, now there's a bunch of these bitches. Oh my god! Oh! Don't you have a bomb in that arm? That's just gonna piss him off. Look at me. Destroy him. Yes, queen. Oh, yeah. Choo, 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 choo. <laughs> Come on, look at me. <laughs> we still a queen. Yes. <laughs> we still a queen. Did you saw that? Did you saw? Oh my gosh. She's 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 just in it too much. But did you saw that? Look at me. It's a bam, bam, bam. Look, look at me, look at me. Look at me! Look at me! Look at me! Bam, bam, bam! <sighs> yes. What are you not telling me? I drank the bottle of Hague. What? You piece of- Oh my god! Oh! Can they stop hurting feeling that, please? I'm afraid to die. <sighs> okay, the succession crisis right now. But you feel not your choice. Right now you can choose. Yeah. Do the right thing. Yeah, save them. Oh my god, I hope she saved them. But I know that Fitz is playing her. I don't think Fitz has feelings for her. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Oh my god. Oh my god, sweetheart. Sweetheart, he needs to wake up. Does he feel any of that? There? What happened? What's going on? Oh my god. Ophelia? I mean, Ada. Time. Oh my god. Oh my god. My Mac. Oh my god. My Time. Mac. Time. No. Oh. Stop it. Can't leave without Mac. <gasps> Mac is here. Say it. Oh shit, am I gonna start liking Ophelia now? Cause she's hot, I would like to like her. Okay, but no, not Fit Simmons, okay, get out. You Look at him, don't kiss him in front of Gemma. I swear to God, I'm a fucking guy. Don't tempt me. Gemma? <laughs> she's a little bit pissed. I have Max. It's so sad that we lost Maze though. We lost Mace. It's me they won't forgive. We don't know the oh my god. We both did things we regret. Oh my god, this <gasps> I knew 
deep inside me when I saw Ada, the first Ada, being so close to Leopold, I knew she was going to come between my fit Simmons. I knew it. There was something inside of me that I knew. My children are in danger. A mother knows. And now look at this shit. Like, can you imagine trying to explain this to someone who hasn't watched it and who doesn't care about his spoilers? Oh, yes, I ship Fitzsimmons. But now, you know, Fitz created an android. And that android, after doing a bunch of things, created an alternate universe world in a tech, like a frame thing world. Um, where she was the the lead of Hydra, which is what goes against Chill, and Fitz being, you know, as evil as she was, she came back as a normal human being after reading it from a weird magical dark uh, book that actually she got to read it because you know she was trying to save. Fitz that was locked in another dimension with Coulson. So after all of this ordeal, he comes back, she comes back as a human, and now she has feelings, and now I'm confused whether if Fitz is still in love with Gemma or kind of has something with Ada, who is no longer Ada, but Ophelia. Did you understand that? How am I going to explain this? But it's still, this has happened, and I hate every second of it, because Fitzsimmons belong together. There's nothing you can do. None of this android is going to stop Fitzsimmons to be canon. Well, they are canon already, but to be endgame. Okay? Because she, he had, has crossed a universe for her. I swear to God, I'm going to have a stroke. One of these days, I'm going to have a stroke. The memory of seeing me shoot that woman. What? Oh, 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 Agnes. You and I hate, I hate Gemma. You. So you're a copy of her, a bad yeah. one. What we felt. Past tense. No, no. Because my future with Gemma is dead. <gasps> Don't say that. Okay. Don't say that. Don't say that. No, no. Stop it. Stop it. it doesn't ruin my heart for two people. Cut her out! And you love Gemma! And you love Gemma! Don't! Stop! Don't! Don't! Leopold! Leopold! Beautiful. And there's only room in your heart for her. Okay, 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 we're good, we're good, we're good. Uh oh. What? Say what the fuck, bitch? <laughs> what do you mean, her? Her, Gemma. What? Gemma is her world. Uh, bitch, you're about to experience heartbreak. What, Leopold? No! Oh, bitch! Oh my God, she's not taking it well. Sweetheart, you can fall in love with someone else, or we can kill you right now. So shut the fuck up. Yeah, but he didn't chose you! Oh no! No, bitch! No, bitch! Just with me! Why is this always to be like this? We're not the enemy here. Oh, stop it! Don't throw him around! Oh my god! Oh my god, she's gonna quick ship? Oh, she has. Oh, he, she has Lincoln's powers as well. What heartbreaks can do. <laughs> I mean, fall in love with Leopold, Fitz, and then he tells you that he doesn't love you. I will be pissed too. We're not robots, Glenn. Oh my the god. Base under the oil rig fell into the sea. Yes. Speedy Gonzalez, girl. It's Speedy Gonzalez, this bitch. Ada got out. Yeah, 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 yeah. <gasps> Ada, I think you're overreacting, bitch. She has all the powers. Try it. Yeah, try it, try it, bitch. You also fall in love with someone in the other universe. Or at least you care about him. Oh my my child, don't don't suffer. I wanna don't suffer, don't suffer. 
Oh my god. Should save us always together. Don't, don't, my baby. Oh my god, stop it. These two are so incredible. The emotions, oh my god. Oh, Ada. Woo, look at who, who's the top. Yes. <laughs> Okay, this is way too kinky, Ada. Even for you. <gasps> Robbie! Oh my god, this is mind blowing! <gasps> yes, baby, yes! Oh my god! Oh my god! The cherry! on top of the cake this is just <sighs> okay guys that was the end of season four episode 21 of marvel's agents of shield also known as the best show on television ever i'm just saying um fantastic episode i mean things you know you have this i feel like this is the this season Things have kind of gone like escalating every single episode. Then you have bang the, the mid season finales for each arc, which are amazing, you know. And then you got what is going to be the season finale, which I think is going to be just mind blowing. I love the fact that. Uh, everything that we have gone through all this season, even with the three arcs, now season freaking four finale is going to be about so much, like, it's a, it's going to connect all of them in a way. Because you have, you still have Ada, you still have the androids, you don't necessarily have Hydra because Hydra, they will work into bringing what we have with the agents of Hydra to this world. You know, and now we have Robbie back, the Ghost Rider back. How, like, I just, I, what can, how can I, what can I say about these writers, about the, the showrunners, how devoted they are to their, to their story? It's just mine fucking blowing like i cannot believe the amount of of oh my god i almost the amount of connections the amount of you know well written and well thought arcs and plans they had for the season it's just i don't know man i they are geniuses they they the, the, here's the thing I feel like they love what they do in order for for someone to pull this you have to love what you do you have to love the characters you have to be committed to every single character even if you lose said characters since you are committed to them you will bring them to justice you know you will give the characters justice for whatever reason if it is that we have to say goodbye to them you know it's just I, I will never stop to praise this show because it's good. It's so, so freaking good. Not a single season. Well, maybe season one of Supergirl is as good as this one. I have watched Arrow season one. It has a very strong, you know, arcs as well. Season two, I'm currently on season two. It's pretty good too. N never. At the same level as Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. It's good. Yes, Arrow. I like Arrow Season 2 very much. I'm enjoying it. Truly, truly enjoying it. Comes nowhere near Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. You know what shows are near as good in, t in terms of, of storytelling as Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D.? Westworld. Uh, even how to get away with murder because they also plan ahead and you know you see the twists and things like that. Game of Thrones. Those shows. Those are the shows that this one is uh, uh, right there. Close to be, you know, as good as them. Of course, Game of Thrones, Westworld have bigger budgets. Have bigger, you know, they can do a lot more because of that budget. You know, but 
Agents of Shield f it stands uh, on its own because of its storytelling. You know, n not having the crazy budgets that Game of Thrones or Westworld can have. Agents of Shield does the same thing and makes us love, hate, panic, cry, laugh, love all of it. All of it in every single episode. I, you guys might be tired of hearing me praise the show and you might say, okay, Julie, you have said this pretty much every single episode of this season, but I'm sorry. I will continue until I feel like it's not good. Because, and honestly, I don't think it will ever not be good, you know? And it's it's a good story. It's a good story. Oh. It means something. It has, it, it has a, a place where it starts, a place where it goes. They know what they're doing. They care about the characters. They care about what they are giving you. And it's just, it's just mind-blowing. This episode, the characters are... Most of the characters are finally up. You know, they are finally awake. They are finally here. Uh, with complications, of course, May is the one who suffers the most. Because she has she's the one who has been inside of the framework the longest. So her mind is tired. Even if she has been asleep, she hasn't been resting. Her brain is still, you know, working 24-7 there in the main... In the framework work she's still you know going at it and her body hasn't had activity in a long time so she has to have problems with walking with staying up with things i'm glad that they did that i'm glad that we also saw you know uh um uh, Coulson kind of lingering, but he has spent less time in the framework than may um i think that it's just so it's also so beautiful where Felinda's coming because to me Felinda has always been there to me you know yes we have had Andrew we know or we knew we know about the fact that uh Coulson was in love with the cellist and things like that I just I believe that at the moment that they met uh they weren't ready for each other you know, and they were building something, something bigger, something more strong than what they had in the past. So everything that has happened to them has been a way for them to, to be ready to be together. You know, I feel like this is the moment. Now, how will my, my queen may react to the fact that he, it took him a long time to figure out it, and, and, you know, he opened the bottle. He actually, you know, kids, she was very upset about that, you know? And at the end of the day, I think that she will understand, but at the same time, it's gonna, it gotta stink a little bit. I remember French has a similar, uh, um, storyline. Which I'm not going to spoil for you guys, but there is a conversation between Olivia and and, and Peter. Uh, when, I'm not going to say when, but there's a conversation in the episode Marionette. I think that's episode... It's either 309 or 4 of, 409. I think it's 409. No, it's 309. Marionette. That episode. Um, I feel like that conversation where she is like he didn't recognize her as well it's so like it could happen here and i will cry if it happens here uh but it's so it's so amazing that we i can i can watch that and if it happens of course but still you know the dynamic between these two characters where right now they are now forced to face what they feel. They are in this point where like. There is no way to deny this anymore. There is no other place to go. Other than. To each other. Okay. So I hope and I pray that that happens. That nothing bad happens in the finale. Because as much as I love Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Because I do. But they are insane with the cliffhangers. And with making us, you know, put the characters together just to get them apart. I was like in the beginning of the season. It's stupid me. Jinx the whole thing. Because I was like, oh, Fitzsimmon hasn't really had anything. They haven't had like, like, like really dark scenes. Or like nothing bad has happened to them. And look what happened. I jinx myself. I will never, ever do that again. Because anytime they have a, a good moment, I'm going to enjoy it. Because they can take it away from me, you know, at any time. So, 
oh my god oh my god i shouldn't have said that i shouldn't have but either way i i think that this episode was just so fantastic so full of of crazy moments uh but I, I i hope that you know when fill in that happened or when they start talking i hope they they uh uh worked it out and they can you know be together because it's been four seasons okay i i need i kind of need them already um then of course we have this uh story with the storyline with ada who is now ophelia officially she's ophelia because she is alive she was born and you know i understand that is more than a dream to them it's like an entire life has been added to their memories you know feelings thoughts stories things like that that in your mind they might start you know to blend so it's kind of crazy because yes this is our may this is our Colson, it will be our Mac, and it will be our Fitz, but this is added with the other personalities that they have inside of the framework. Uh, he is fit. I don't think Fitz is, he, he's very empathetic. He is, uh, uh, he's not gonna go and kill people or anything like that, but the regrets, the feeling that he could do it, the feeling that he is no different from war, which in, I mean, I hate to admit it, but it kind of is true because, you know, with having a different upbringing, War turned out to be an agent of S.H.I.E.L.D. and he turned out to be the doctor inside of HYDRA. You know, it, it's crazy. It's crazy how single events can determine what you're going to be in your entire life uh, after those events. So it's, it's crazy that he thought about that. Uh, I also, you know, for a minute, I was kind of like... Kind of like rooting for for Adam, like kinda, okay, not that much, because she was like, oh, I know what love is, what what saving a life is, what you know, all of this good thing, good emotions that she was experienced, and then she she was like so sure that he was gonna pick her, and then he was like, yeah, I can I cannot take her away from my heart, and she was like, her what do you mean she turned into a crazy woman and now we know that she has also been experimented with the inhumans powers meaning that she is uh kind of like a inhuman hybrid or something like that that she has been added a lot of powers she has teletram teletransportation as the blind dude had gordon then we have also had she also has uh, Robbie's powers. Uh, what else he ha she has? Robbie's powers and this one. Oh, but Robbie's not an inhuman. Oh, but she has. What? It looked like Robbie's powers. I might be wrong. But she also has Lincoln's powers. Um, but either way, she is a killing machine, and she is a dangerous woman. With a heart, with her heart broken by Leopold Fitz, which I'm glad that he broke her heart because I was like, if you dare to say that you're in love with her, knowing that Gemma is the love of your life, I'm gonna slap you, my boy. I'm gonna be, you know, social services are gonna come because I'm, you know, abusing my child. Thankfully, he was smart enough to not say that, and he loves. Gemma, of course, and he chose Gemma, who Gemma was listening to all of this, and she was about to die because she she thought that he was gonna choose Ophelia, and that broke my heart as well. And it, it was just it was a it was a roller coaster this episode. I I managed to not get tear up. I was I remained calm like I always am because I'm always calm. What the hell? But like. It was so it was it was it was heartbreaking to see her like that. Uh, but then uh, she goes into a rampage because she's like, oh, "I love you across a dimension for you and blah blah blah." But of course, you know she's human. She has just learned about consent, about love, about everything. So she has to. Uh, she doesn't understand how to handle this type of emotions. Uh, because for a moment I thought, yeah, that is true. All the things that she was put in, 
that she has done is because Radcliffe programmed her to do so. She found loopholes, yes, but ultimately the dark hole talked through him and made him see that, you know? Now, the dark hole doesn't seem to affect Ivanov that much. I don't really care about Ivan. I hope he dies. And like all the versions of him to die, we need to find the head to destroy it so we don't have more of them because he's the one who controls all the other versions. But either way, I think that uh, uh, it, it was just this moment, uh, th th that whole, you know, and then she like kind of kissed him and she was about to top him and then she started to bang his head against the the floor and she killed him you know and she's just full with rage and things like that and like oh my god i am truly scared and to top it all yo-yo who i love and i care so much about her you guys know how much i love my yo-yo because she is you know my yo-yo so as much as i love her i think that she is Yes, of course, we we know the risk of him staying there, you know. It's possible that at one point right now, you know, the the ship will go down and she he will die for real because, you know, the, he will be disconnected from the machine. But the thing is that, you know, yes, you, you have to go in and try to save him from himself, trying to, you know, I hope that when she gets there, she's actually not telling him it's not real, it's not real, come back to me. Because as much as I love the romantic side of Mac and Yo-Yo, and I, as much I, as I love, you know, the romantic storylines we get on, uh, on the show, there is nothing more strong than the love of a parent to a child. We have seen that with... Um, Daisy's dad. We see him. We see it with Colson. We see him with May. We see it, you know, with well, now Fitzsimmons because they are really romantically in love. But like we have seen it, so we don't need for for Mac to choose Yo Yo over Hope. We we do need that Mac choose uh chose chooses uh reality over this dream you know you might say it is a dream but how much will it suck that he will now have memories of his daughter will you consider this as a at least you had this few moments with her or will you say that this will haunt him and will bring him down i don't know it could go either way either way as a parent i don't think i will be able to do it I will say, you know what? Kill me with my daughter, with my son right now. I, this is what, who I love, you know? Uh, the, the love of a parent is a lot more stronger. Sometimes, you know, this is coming from my experience. It might differ from you, but the love that you have for your children, the real ones, I'm not talking about the, all of my children that I have here, but like for your real children, uh, children, the love that you have for them is stronger and, and, and bigger than and it's also different from the one that you have for your partner or for, you know, your wife your girlfriend, whatever it is so at the end of the day I know what I will do, I know what I will choose, I will choose my son my, my child a thousand times even if that means that I don't get out, you know I will choose that. So we'll see how they handle that. I'm kind of not concerned, but I'm kind of cautious to see how they're going to do it because I want a true representation of what, you know, this f paternal love means to Mac. So I, I want to see. I have I trust the writers. So we'll see how they handle this. Uh, a lot of crazy things will happen in the season finale. I am excited to watch it. Not going to watch it tonight. I'm going to let... Just in case some things went off my head uh, when I was watching the episodes, if there are some things that I missed that you guys want to point out so I can, you know, go into the next episode noticing everything. I do read all you guys' comments. Sometimes I don't have that much time to reply to every single one, but I do read them and I do put hard. I don't know if you guys get a notification, but I do give your comments uh, hearts. Uh, especially the ones that I read, I put a heart in it. So you guys know that I, I, I did read it. But sometimes, like I said, I don't have enough time to reply to everyone. Um, 
but yeah, this was a truly amazing, amazing, crazy ass episode. I just, you know, I wish that I, I could watch it right now. But honestly, I, I want to hear the feedback from you guys before I watch the finale. By the time that you're watching it on YouTube, I already watched the finale. Um, and, you know, there is this nor normal thing I do after every single season finale of every show that I do is that I take a break. I'm not taking, I'm not going to take a break. I'm, the only thing I'm going to do is that I'm going to do the reaction for the bloopers. And then I'm pretty sure I'm going to continue with season five. Because I want to, one, I want to finish this show by the end of this year. Two, I don't want to stop. That's it. <laughs> Those are all the reasons. Uh, but yeah, I will do my reaction to the bloopers. And then the following week, depend on the, the what they what happens in the finale. You know, if it's too crucial, I would just jump into the next one and do the reaction of for the bloopers. But I will do my reactions for the bloopers for sure. And yeah, well, that's about it. That thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for joining me. Thank you for all your support during this entire uh, fourth and fourth season of this show. You guys are truly fantastic. Thank you for everything. Thank you for, for letting me enjoy this show, for being amazing fans. You guys are, the Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. fans are m just amazing. You guys has nev have never ex spoiled anything for me. Crucial key parts that I will think people will, you know, um, spoil for me. You have never spoiled anything for me. And, and I truly appreciate that. So, yeah. Uh, thank you for that. Give it a lot of thumbs up if you love Marvel's Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Subscribe for more comment on the comment section down below. All your thoughts about this episode, about this reaction. What is your favorite part of the reaction? Also, ooh, sorry. Also, hit the notification bell so you get a notification every time I upload a new reaction video for Marvel's Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Also, go to Patreon to watch the full on car reaction video with over an almost an hour and 20 minutes of reaction and review. So if you want to watch that, go to Patreon. Link, as always, will be in the description down below. And I think that's it. Thank you so much for joining me. I will see you guys next time for more reaction videos for Marvel's Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Mwah. Bye, guys.